Craps is a complicated casino game where players take it in turns to shoot dice and they check the total and see if they win depending on the different totals. There's a lot of rules with a lot of different variables. So we'll start with the two most common bets and that's the pass line and the don't pass line. What you need to realize about these two is that they are opposites. When the pass line wins, the don't pass bar loses. So for the first throw, okay, if you put money on one of these two, you roll it, you get either a seven or 11. This is one of the natural numbers. You get one of these straight away, the pass line wins, the don't pass bar loses. If you get a crap, it's the opposite of a natural, the don't pass bar wins and the pass line loses. Then you get one of the playable numbers. This is where the game gets a bit more interesting. When you get a playable numbers, one of these six is selected and the pass line is bidding that this number will come up again, it has to be the same number before um, a seven comes up. So for example, if we get six, we roll it, we get five, whatever, and if a seven comes up, the don't pass bar wins. If the six comes up before the seven, the pass line loses. There are a lot of other bets. The first one is the field. The field bets that in the immediate roll, a two, three, four, nine, 10, 11, or 12 will come up. So the reason two and 12 are circles, is they give slightly different odds. Two and 12 offer two to one, while the rest of them offer evens, so offer one to one. The next type of bets are the side bets. This, again, some of them bet on the immediate roll, some of them have a more longer lasting outcome. So any craps, um, 11, three, hard 12, hard two, bet on the next roll being a crap, which is again, two or 12, 11 or three, that's a six and a five or a two and a one, and a hard 12 and a hard two. Hard means it has to be a double. So if you want a hard 12, it has to be a six or a six. The reason why these bet on the next ones is there's no other way for a 12 or a two to come up. These four are slightly different. So a hard 10, for example, bets that a double five will come up before either another 10 or a seven. So for example, if you bet this, a bet on hard 10, and a six and a four comes up, you lose. A seven comes up, you lose. Any, if the double five comes up, you win. If anything else happens, if it's any other roll, the bet keeps going until one of those three outcomes happen. And they are the rules of craps.